and welcome to The Nation Wants to Troll. I'm your CTO, Chief Trolling Officer Ashwin Mushran, and this is where we give you news and then some interesting facts which you may or may not give a fuck about. First up, something for the cricket fans. Master Blaster Sachin Tendulkar's autobiography, Playing It My Way, has just released. Yaar, sabse pehli copy, please, Maria Sharapova ko bhej do. I pity Sachin's neighbor. His mum must be taunting him. Padosi ki ladki ko dekho. 10th standard he pass kiya, phir bhi kitab likhdi. Tune kya okhada? Now, in the book, Sachin has slammed former Indian coach Greg Chappell and his coaching tactics, which is not very surprising. God ko vese bhi chappal pasand nahi. Sachin calls Chappell a ringmaster who imposed his ideas on players. He also said Chappell came to him asking him to be the captain and take over the captaincy from then skipper Rahul Dravid, saying, Together we could control Indian cricket for years. Well, Sachin, someone already beat Chappell to it. These revelations come nearly seven years after the incidents. Just like his 100th century, Sachin took too long to get to this milestone. And when it was finally achieved, nobody really gave a fuck about it. Characteristic Sachin. Meanwhile, in the IPL spot-fixing scandal, the Mudgal Committee has submitted its report to the Supreme Court. The panel's preliminary report suggested that Guru Nathan Mayapan, son-in-law of Don Corleone N. Srinivasan, could be involved in placing bets on teams. But listen to this. According to Mint, in the transcripts of the report, Pakistani umpire Asad Rof received several gifts, such as seven pairs of sports shoes, 15 pairs of trousers, jeans, pants, shorts, 21 shirts, t-shirts, 12 leather belts, four leather purses, one pen, one hair trimmer, which was probably mine, and seven ladies' dress material. Aata, chini, gehu, bagheera bhi manga lete. Rashan bhi aa jata free mein. Aur bookie ki kya halat hui hogi? Socho. Nahin, nahin, socho. Bechara soch raha hoga, Rof Mercedes ka ya 3 BHK flat maange ga. Instead, he now has to go to the big bazaar Wednesday sale to fulfill his demands. In other news, an airplane bound for Sydney was made to fly back to LA after a foul smell was emitting from its toilet due to leaking sinks. Travellers claimed toilet waste was making its way down the aisle and the smell was unbearable. Or as we like to call it, Indian Railways. If the railways decided to take such a step, no trains in India would ever move ahead. Speaking of railways, the Bangladeshi Railway Minister Mujbul Haq a 67-year-old man married a 29-year-old woman recently. Over 700 people reportedly attended the wedding from the minister's side. I'm sure half of them were emergency medical staff. This is Huck's first marriage. The minister's aide says he was so busy with his political career that he never had the time to marry. Does this even need a joke? Meanwhile, people in Dhaka were seen singing Hashtag Sada Hak Gets to Fuck And now for some entertainment news Jaya Bachchan has slammed the film Happy New Year by calling it the most nonsensical film of the year Jaya said she watched it only because of Abhishek Typical Indian mother Meanwhile, Farah Khan was seen murmuring Jaya Ji, please Abhi in the film, Abhishek vomits many times, which was probably what the audience was doing in the theatre as well. The film released on Diwali, which was great because those who came out after watching it could do something less torturous, like burning themselves along with firecrackers before 10pm, of course. Happy New Year has already entered the top grossing list of movies from India. Doom 3 is at the top of this list, a film that managed to be awful even after copying Christopher Nolan. Other films on the list are Chennai Express, due to which the southern states almost considered leaving India, Kick, a film that combines the destruction of Salman Khan and Chetan Bhagat, and Krish 3, also called Roshan Parivar Employment Guarantee Scheme. And that's it from this episode of The Nation Wants to Troll. Until next time, this is me, Ashun Mushran, saying goodbye. Shaba Kher, Anupam Kher, Kiran Kher. Sikandar Kher. I don't care. Really, I don't.